one small thing. Yeah. When you bring me out, can you introduce me as Joker? A fictional movie about violence leads to extra security measures in real life. Joker is debuting just seven years after a theater shooting during the premiere of Batman left 12 dead and many wounded in Colorado. Theaters are now giving more attention to safety during Joker showings. Tonight, Two Works for You, Sierra Pizarro tells us if security precautions reached Tulsa theaters. All AMC theaters, including those in Tulsa, are banning face masks, and for good reason. Threats associated with the movie have been made. Joker, a movie about an outcast lashing out with violence, hit theaters yesterday. There's been a lot of tension for the past couple of weeks because everybody wants to see it, but so many people are afraid of it. The FBI and Homeland Security have monitored multiple online mass shooting threats surrounding the movie. They're concerned potential shooters could use the 2012 Aurora, Colorado shooting as inspiration. All this just to watch a film about the Joker is, is really intense because previously the Joker had just been like a goofy cartoon that sprays acid from a flower. SC King saw Joker last night at the AMC in Tulsa on 41st. He says there were officers around and bags were searched. And it was intense. I've never had my bag checked before at a movie theater. But I got in there and they were like, because of the movie, we got to make sure that you don't have anything. I was like, oh, you're looking for weapons. They're like, yeah. AMC isn't alone. Landmark Theaters, which owns 52 theaters in 27 markets, also banned masks, costumes, and toy weapons during Joker's run. Back to the threats, the FBI found them to be not credible, and they say no specific venue or location has been targeted. In Tulsa, Sierra Pizarro, two works for you. Police departments in New York, Chicago and Los Angeles do confirm stepped up patrols will be made at theaters showing the film. In fact, the Los Angeles Police Department says it will have high visibility at theaters showing that movie. Movie theater franchise Alamo Draft House is warning parents to leave their kids at home for this one. In a statement, the company says Joker is rated R for a reason and that there is rough language and brutal violence. The statement also says the movie is not for kids and that they probably won't like it anyway because there's no Batman. The chain says they will not alter the movie or ban people from seeing it. Covering Wagner County now, the Oklahoma